Greetings presentation parishioners, happy Friday. I hope your Easter season is going well and you're enjoying the warmer weather as the uh, week comes to a close. We had that interesting snow this week, so a little snow in April is a reminder that we're not in control, right? That God uh, is the one that uh, controls this great big world of ours. But it was a nice little surprise, glad, glad it didn't last very long, uh, but warmer weather is ahead. You'll see that I'm sitting here in front of a statue of Jesus as the Good Shepherd. This weekend is traditionally called Good Shepherd Sunday, always part of the Easter season. So it's a reminder that certainly Jesus is our Good Shepherd, the one who cares for us, brings us comfort, uh, is there to lead us in the right direction, but also a reminder that all of us are called to be Good Shepherds uh, to one another by the ways that we live our faith in this world certainly where so many people are hurting and people are struggling uh, that's a way for us to remember who we're called to be that we're called to imitate that love of jesus as the good shepherd it's also a, a weekend where we remember the importance of vocations in our church so continue to pray uh, that men and women will step up to serve the church and certainly encourage others in your world and your families those that you may know that we have a vocation, encourage them to explore that. It's always a good opportunity uh, to be a reminder that we all need to be that good example and encourage others uh, in their own vocation. Also, this time of year, we continue to celebrate sacrament. So this weekend will be another one of our first communion weekends. So some of the families will be coming to the noon mass. There'll also be a special 2 p.m. mass for first communion families. So keep all those children in your prayers. Remember to get signed up for Mass. There is room at most of our Masses. Uh, the noon is a little more full than usual just because of the First Communions, but there's still room at all the Masses. So remember to get your, yourself signed up. Also, this coming Monday, April 26th, we'll be celebrating the Sacrament of Confirmation with our high school teens. Uh, Bishop Johnston will be here to celebrate the sacrament this year. So this will be an exciting time as they're filled with the Spirit and as they're encouraged to go forth and share their faith in meaningful ways. But keep all of our children and our teens celebrating these sacraments in your prayers. They need all of us to support them on their journey, but let's uh, keep them close to our hearts as they prepare to receive these sacraments. Also this weekend is one of our collections for the poor. Uh, so remember, if you have an envelope, you can just put that in the regular collection baskets as you enter Mass. You can also give online. Uh, those For the Poor collections throughout the year are just ways that we can support those in need uh, throughout the year. So this is a way for us to uh, assist those who may be struggling. We do have people show up at our parish office every week asking for assistance. This is a way for us as a parish community uh, to assist those in need. So please be generous with that. Also, just a reminder that our big OLP auction is this Saturday. So tomorrow, uh, April 25th, we are April 24th. So we hope that you will join us in some way. I know some people will be attending in person, but if you're not, please support the auction in some way. You can get on and register yourself and bid on items, or you can just simply donate to the auction through our online giving. But do something. We really do need everyone's support this year. This provides a lot of funding uh, for our school and other uh, ministries associated with the school throughout the year. So we need everybody's support because uh, in this challenging year, uh, we, we do have you know, more students and more needs, all those things. So please support it in some way. So get out there and start bidding on items or just give and donate uh, to make the auction a very successful one. But bless you. Know my prayers for all of you. Uh, sending my love and prayers. So have a blessed weekend and we look forward to seeing you soon. Amen.